One of the first studies in transgender fertility preservation has just come out in fertility and sterility, and I'm here to tell you all about it. Hey, Kathy Bernardo here from the Northeast Assisted Fertility Group. We had one transgender client um, from male to female. So what she did was preserve her sperm before her transition, and she went on to have a healthy baby with the help of a donor and a surrogate, and that worked out really great. But this particular study has to do with female to male transition. So here, why don't you just take a look at it? And here is the article in November 2019's issue of Fertility and Sterility. So this covers 26 female to male transitioning patients. And they were able to um, have regular IVF and egg, or regular egg retrievals, even though some began their testosterone treatment. So if they were about to do a retrieval, they had to stop the testosterone temporarily for the actual stimulation period. But some of them actually went on um, to have successful uh, results, even though they already started the testosterone. So because these People were relatively young. Most of them just banked their eggs, but of the seven that had sperm and actually fertilized the eggs and created embryos, all the transfers were successful. And there was a comparative group of cisgendered people who were kind of comparable as well. But what this study concluded was that um, people transitioning are perfectly capable of preserving their fertility. Uh, that's not a problem. Most of them do want to have families in the future. In fact, their success rates were comparable or even better than the cisgendered control group. And there may have been many factors, maybe because these transitioning um, female to male maybe have been younger. But for whatever reason, there's no reason not to preserve your fertility if you are transitioning from female to male. Did you know, I did not know this, that until 2015, 24 European countries required transitioning sex um, changes, anyone um, in the process of transitioning, to become sterilized. And that's just horrible, I can't imagine that. The European Court of Human Rights has determined that to be a human rights violation, so slowly they're not, being, they're not doing that anymore. But um, of course, there's nothing like that in this country. So the conclusion of the study is that transitioning female to male, um, transgendered people can have fantastic results, can preserve their fertility, even if they've already started the hormone therapy. They would just have to stop that. So I'm sure there'll be many more of these um, studies in the future as more and more people take advantage of this technology. So I hope that was helpful. If so, please give this a thumbs up. Please put any comments below, subscribe to my channel, and go to assistedfertility.com for lots more information on third-party reproduction. Thanks so much for watching.